As you may have heard, OpenAI just released a huge update to all of its models and APIs. What's the big deal about the Vision API in particular? Well, as you know, ChatGPT is a general purpose AI that allows you to enter in text and prompt this AI, and it will use its vast knowledge of the internet and provide an answer to you. Up until now, you were restricted to only using text. But with the Vision AI, now you can include images and prompt against images. The field of computer vision isn't new, but it's always been segmented into major algorithms that you need to learn yourself. Image classification, image object detection, OCR, which means extracting text from images. You had to learn these individually, or at least learn the APIs that leverage these algorithms under the hood, and then wire them together to solve problems. The power of the Vision API by OpenAI is it's a single endpoint that's, a, that's, that's general purpose that allows you to execute these queries against images. One area that seems especially interesting to me is the ability to extract data from web pages. If you've ever tried your hand at web scraping before, you know that automations can be very brittle because HTML can change structure at any time. And uh, however, we can pass screenshots to OpenAI that will allow you to extract text from the image without having to worry about the underlying structure of HTML. So for example, we have this uh, particular listing for a circular saw, and I'm gonna use Pipedream here to show you how you can simply take a screenshot and then pass it to OpenAI. So I'm gonna show you a working example of how you can extract data from a screenshot using OpenAI. Here in Pipedream, you can easily integrate OpenAI and other apps with your workflows. And luckily for us, we have an integrated native puppeteer action that's called screenshot a page. And then we can just and then we can just pass in the URL to that item. So this will create this will capture a screenshot of this URL, and we can even instruct it to grab a full page just so that we're not missing any key details about this listing. The result will be a base64 encoded string, so we can just copy this path and then start with our OpenAI call. So we look for OpenAI in Pipedream and select it, and then select the then select the chat action. Don't forget to select your API key and then choose the new vision model that ChatGPT offers. And here we can ask the uh, AI, please extract the title and price of the item. And don't forget, we need to actually pass in a screenshot. So we'll use this images field, and then we can add our base64 encoded string. Now, don't forget, you have to add the special prepended data and image. Uh, kind of like, don't forget, you have to add the base64 encoded prefix to tell OpenAI that this is an image file. But then we just pass in our screenshot data, we click test, and this will interact with the new Vision API. Read, actually visually read the image, and then use our prompt to guide the AI on an answer. Let's see what it came up with. So you can see under the generated image, the title of the item is the DeWalt cordless six inch circular saw, and the current price is $4. Wow, so yeah, that's, that's right on. It was a circular saw and the current price is in fact $4. So this is an example of using OCR plus a general purpose, just a general purpose query against the page without having to learn the HTML structure and extract using Cheerio or uh, Scrapy or any, other, any one of the uh, HTML parsers in the language of choice. Stay tuned for more examples and tutorials on how to leverage the, the power of AI APIs with the automation ease of Pipedream workflows.